Hey, what's up guys? Jeremy here, and in this episode of Everything iDevice, we're going to go over a tweak called Clockify. Now, if you're familiar with the old school tweak, Live Clock, this is based off of the same concept. Uh, one part of this tweak, as you can see, it will put the live time on your clock app icon. As you can see, the, uh, the little seconds hand rolling around there, and it is the current time being displayed there. Now, this tweak is much, much more than just the app icon. It also will put a clock right within your notification center, as you see right there. And also, on the lock screen. Now this does have a few settings, so let's jump into the settings panel for Clockify and take a look. So here is the settings panel for Clockify. First is the clock icon, the actual app icon itself. You can have that be on or off. Display style, you can have be default, which switches between the day clock and the night clock, depending on the hour of the day. And you can have always day, so I'll show you what day looks like. It's just the regular clock looking app icon with the white center. Now I'll show you what night looks like. It's basically just all black, which looks really nice. So there you go. And then my preference is no background. It will show the app icon without any numbers within the app icon. I do like that look. Next section is lock screen clocks. Now this is based off of the world clocks you have set up within your clock app. You have local time, local time plus world clock, and then just world clock which does allow you to, to swipe through different locations, which is very cool. Same concept for Notification Center. Local time, local time plus world clock, and just world clock. And then you can actually change the plug-in height between 71 pixels or 92, so I'll show you the difference. So here's 71, which is smaller, and then 92 pixels, which is just slightly bigger. And uh, that is basically it. And again, it is called Clockify. It is $1 from the Big Boss repo. Let me know what you guys think about this tweak down in the comments. This is Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and I'll catch you guys later.